Hey guys, that's Doug. It's Miles talking from MSS Moncton, and we got a lot of requests on how to make the stirrup guards for single stick. So, in the description, there is a link to the pattern. Print off the pattern and trace it onto your piece of plastic. Right here, we're actually using a rain barrel. Um, you want a piece of plastic that's about four millimeters thick and has a little bit of give to it, but is still fairly rigid, okay? You can see that on the dots on the pattern, Doug is just marking those up with a little dot so that we have um, our spot that we're gonna drill through later. Now he's on the scroll saw, okay? Um, you can use a jigsaw with this just fine, you know, wh whatever you gotta do to cut this, okay? It's gonna be easier for you on a scroll saw. Start by taking uh, the big rough cuts, then move into the smaller, more precise cuts, okay? It's just gonna make your life a little bit easier and you're going to end up making some cleaner cuts this way. Next up, we've got the drill press, okay? That's a step bit. It's three quarters inch, so it matches up with the sticks that we're using from Purple Heart Armory. Okay, if you don't have a step bit, don't worry about it too much. You know, your handheld drill with a, um, with a regular bit is gonna work okay. Next up, we're just gonna take it over to the sander. Really straightforward, you know, you can hand sand this. It's nice to have um, a bigger unit, right? It makes your life a little bit easier, but you're just gonna smooth down all the little bumps in those edges. Unless you're the master of the saw, you're gonna need to sand it a little bit, okay? <laughs> and after that, you're just gonna take your little knife, do that stock removal, tidy it all up, get all those little tailings off of there. There's Doug, handsome fella, doing his thing. Nice job, Doug. <laughs> All right, from here, going to take it to the heat gun, okay? Now, what you're going to do here is you're going to take the curve out of it. Depending on what piece of plastic you use, you might have something straight. We're using a rain barrel, a four millimeter thick rain barrel. So, we're, uh, we have to kind of flatten these out a little bit, all right? We just take the warp out of them with the heat gun. Then we're going to concentrate the heat where we drilled those holes, okay? And that's going to let us easily get it on over the stick. But as it cools, it's actually going to uh, tighten up a little bit and give you a really nice grip on the stick. And now here's the other end doing the exact same thing. going to slip that right over the top. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. How do you like that? And now, we'll go for the final fit. And you'll see, it should still be a little bit pliable um, from, where, from where it was heated up. You'll just bend that over, push them through. As it cools down, those two, um, those two insertion points are going to contract a little bit and make a little bit of a tighter grip on the stick. Now, we're using the ones from Purple Heart. They have little stoppers already installed on the bottom, which is perfect. And just like that, there's Doug with his handiwork. And that's a nice looking little stirrup guard. And you know what? That takes about seven minutes to make. Enjoy, guys. <laughs> 